the beauty and power of Mother Nature. No place knows her better than the Dock and Dine. The popular Old Saybrook restaurant has met with her destructive force more than once. And what's surprising is how much weight was on top of, on top of this floor, mm -hmm. and it still popped it up and shattered the entire granite bar all over the place. Last week's storm surge broke right through the floor, flooding the restaurant, not to mention the entire parking lot. Today, as workers continue the cleanup, they brace for another hit. Even though you can still see the sound stirring below this floor, which is now open because of the last storm, folks here say they're not too worried about this storm because even if a little water gets in, everything has already been removed and damaged. Here? I mean, if a little bit more water comes up here, at this point, it's like we already had three feet of water. So if six inches comes up here, I mean, not a big deal because we already have a lot more to do. Most of the furniture, plates, and other equipment, which survived Sandy, are now raised above where any new flooding is expected. So while this storm may not pose the same threat as last week's, it does serve as the same reminder of how vulnerable this waterfront restaurant is. After Irene, it was closed for almost a year. We are absolutely rebuilding, no matter what. If we have to knock down the building and build it 15 feet higher, or if we rebuild it the way it is, it's going to happen. There is no way that the restaurant will not reopen. Guaranteed. That is what many customers and workers want to hear. The forces of Mother Nature, both beautiful and powerful. In Old Saybrook, Tina Detell, News 8.